Hi there, it's Julie Kinnear of the Julie Kinnear team and I'm standing right in front of 4 Goldwyn Avenue. We're in the Mount Dennis neighborhood. This is a dead end street. And how great is this? A nice big detached brick home. Got a really wide mutual drive, cute little front porch. Uh, that's Jane. We're really close to Jane in Eglinton, but again, a nice uh, family neighborhood. There's lots of kids on the street. Uh, both sides of the neighbors are seniors and own their homes. And uh, uh, this is a jewel. This is a bonus, man. Who knew you could uh, afford such a nice house in Toronto? Uh, so it's a detached three, three bedrooms, two full baths, um, totally move in condition, ready to go here. And I'm telling you, it's a nice hot day. And guess what? Uh, there's air conditioning in here. Phew! So uh, it's great for families. It's great for entertaining. Nice young couple could move in and start uh, start your new life here. Uh, so nice dining room area. Fits lots of uh, furniture and again, dinner you know dinner parties galore. This living room, they're good principal rooms. And this big couch set, you know, you'd never believe that you could fit it in except it's in here and now you know that it's a big, big room. And they've got very pretty picture windows starting from the front and the back. Actually, the windows and the blinds were all replaced a couple of years ago. So that's a really expensive, nice upgrade. There's hardwood floors here uh, and lots of space in the kitchen. Uh, good little layout again. You can walk out to here and uh, one of the neat things they did. Okay, so that's the front hall walking in from the street, but most of the time you're going to be entering through the back because that's where the garage is. So instead of having a front hall closet, they turned that into a pantry, which is a major huge bonus. Uh, because you walk back here to the bonus room, what I call the mud room is the bonus room. I mean, they've turned it into this super cute mud room area. You know, if you've got kids or outdoor gear or, you know, strollers or soccer or hockey gear or whatever, uh, you've got lots of space for that and a nice double closet here to go. And of course, if you're entering from the back, the garage or the parking, uh, it's super convenient coming in with your groceries and all that good stuff. And uh, you can walk out here and you got your cute little patio. And uh, you know, if you've got dogs, there's a huge yard. If you've got a green thumb, it's 140 feet deep. It's massive and it's awesome. And you can see even the neighbors keep theirs really pretty. And hey, there's space for a basketball court. I love it. So you're getting a good view of everything here. Uh, you know, kids running around. You could have a little kid pool. You can have uh, gardening galore, dog run, what have you. I'm going to show you the next second and, and basement next. Uh, so I just wanted to give you a little update on the no location. Not sure if you know where Mount Dennis is. We're in the West End. We're around Jane and Eglinton. So really close to like Blair West Village, the Stockyards, the Junction, those sort of neighborhoods. Really easy transit. Uh, of course you go straight up Jane to, to uh, the 401. You can go straight down Jane, down South Kingsway and, and you're on the Gardener and that kind of thing. But you've also got the Eglinton Crosstown which is coming and the Weston stop is very close by. So you're going to be, you know, across town and way faster. It's awesome, exciting, and it's coming within a couple of years, max. And, uh, and you've got the UP Express, which is from Weston Village. And that, you, it goes right downtown itself. Uh, we're right near the Eglinton Flats. Uh, there's a number of tennis courts there, great green space, uh, paths, biking, walking, running, all that kind of stuff. You've got a uh, really friendly neighborhood, good schools. Uh, you've got the York Regional um, York uh, Health Center now, which is that brand new facility a couple years ago. It's spectacular, state of the art. Uh, of course, we're all COVID and oh, we don't know when it's all going to be open, but it's all coming and we're going to be in phase three soon and we're going to be enjoying all of it again. Uh, so it's really a, a special opportunity. This neighborhood is improving all the time and I hope that, uh, you know, you check it out. So this house has lots of great... Uh, closet space so here's the linen closet outside the bathroom the full four-piece renovated bathroom with a tub very nice and those gorgeous windows everywhere and there's lots of tile work and lots of charm and character you know you can see around the doors and the trim uh, nice hardwood floors so there's three bedrooms this is the smallest of the three and of course with people working from home it's nice to have like three bedrooms You've even got a closet here, but also it's nice to, um, you know, if you wanted to use one of them as a home office or whatever, 
you could convert the basement into a guest room because it's also got a four four piece this is the master it's extra you know spacious easily fit queen or king size bed uh, that overlooks the front porch and again it has its own closet space and um, and don't you love these videos you get to see it all you get to see it all tons of fun anyway and uh, and then here's the third one and it, it opens into the backyard again another nice big spacious bedroom here so you know I mean the yard if you're a gardener how great is that it's got the you know big grass area lots of parking uh, it's nice to have so much you know a, a separate garage you know there's a lot of boxes being ticked from this house so uh, or I'm just entering the front hall here and I'm gonna sneak you down to the basement and you get a little peek into the rest of the house as we go so the basement is another extra bonus uh, because it's got good ceiling height and it's got a full recreation room down here if you wanted to have uh, you know again if we're working from home home office because there's windows on all sorts of windows and again if you wanted to have a couch that turned into a bed or whatever you can have this sort of as your guest room as well uh, and good mechanicals you can see the upgraded wiring and nice storage in the laundry area look at those beautiful front loaders that's nice and here's the forced air gas furnace and the hot water tank and here is the full very large and spacious uh, bathroom that would be Again, great for the guests and stuff. So you gotta check out this house for Gold Goldwyn. It's it's a gold winner. 